it seems like Marvel is trying to take an about face. And as they showed at D23, like everything they announced was what, Ken? Sequels. Sequels, reboots, and newly acquired legacy IPs. It was Incredibles 3. Um, what was that Spanish one with the guitar? It was like a sequel to that one. They had a, a clip of uh, Gay Doctor Who in it. Like, Don't we have that like clip? Why aren't we playing uh, that? Do we? I didn't grab it. I, it. I can grab it if you want to go about your point. But yeah, like everything was just like literally the, the trailer was. Oh, you know what? I know how to find it. I, I retweeted it. Um, The trailer was just like, this is all new and shit like that. And then just proceeded to show you nothing but sequels, reboots, and <laughs> shit that we've seen 30 years ago. Like one of the, like the Doctor Who show, that show's been around for 60 fucking years. Not for long. No. All right, so here, here, here it is. So that's Moana, Moana two. Ratatouille. Moana will make money. Uh, are they doing the a Ray, Ray movie? movie? I guess I did here. So that's there's a lot of little kids that like Moana. Wally, -E, probably gonna do Wally. -E. There's a Frozen. Frozen. The problem with Frozen is they've made so many like sequels to Frozen that it's not gonna have the same hit that it did before. Now here's another Avatar. That's Disney. Yeah. Disney owns Avatar. Oh, now they're doing the Mufasa the live movie. Action, the live action Mufasa movie that's coming. Is I, be I didn't so get bad. what what the trailer was. I didn't get the relationship dynamic. Like, oh, they're brothers. And then I couldn't tell which line was which. Yeah, they can't do this live action shit because it just looks weird. Like It's, it's not, not even live too. action. It's all CG. All of it. Well, that's what you know what I mean. We're trying to make it look real. <clears throat> and it just looks it just looks fucking weird and unsettling. And I know I know I even I even fell for the trailer. I'll go over it later. More low key. Trailers, but... I thought they ended it where he's just what the fuck else can he do? He's just sitting there holding time in his hand. Oh yes, we we watched it off air, Spruce Goose. Yeah, I I was like Ken sent, sent me the link, and I was just being an asshole. He was like, guess who the bad guys are? And I was just being an asshole, and I said white people, and he said close, so I responded <laughs> white people. And I haven't watched it. We should watch. it. I mean, technically that was closer, tonight. but it I I wasn't prepared to see what I was gonna see in the trailer. I'm just. I, a pride of literally albino lions trying to kill Mufasa <laughs> and Scar. Uh, I bet they're, I bet they're like not, they'll do something where they're not even from Africa or something like that. They're like <laughs> colon, they're colonizing the area. Africa. Yeah, they're, they're we are English from lions. South, Africa. <laughs> South African lions. Where, where do the yellow ones come in and start making them escalators and shit? <laughs> the only, the only South part of an area that's good, South Africa. <laughs> Not, not on which side you're apartheid to. <laughs> <laughs> you're apartheid of. <laughs> Another scene. God, it just looks... Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, and the, they released the Snow White trailer finally. We might have to watch that here in a few minutes. It's going to be another interesting trying to figure out they how announced, they're going to do... What, so Toy they announced Story another five. Incredibles? Another... Uh, what is the one with the fucking guitar and the Spanish kid and the dead people? I don't know what that is you're talking about. Uh, I know what it is. I it's the one with the, the death. Mjorda, Murta, Aztec what's, what's... death mass and all that stuff. Like it looks like all the candy skulls it, and shit. It was a good movie. Yeah, it it like, no, it looks like it looks like it, it would be a uh, Jack Skellington movie. But it, what's death in like Spanish? Mjorda, Murta. No, it's, somebody's uh... gonna put it in the chat. <laughs> hey, why don't you stop and look it up on Google and stop the whole show? Coco. You were telling death, how cool death that in a uh, thing is Coco. Coco, Coco yeah. yeah. They're doing a Coco 2. Peter Pan. Alien Aliens the one thing that they've shown that I'm like, alright, I want to say. Oh, and Andor. I'll, I'll watch another season of Andor. We're this is the under the like, Disney umbrella? Is that what this is? Yeah, every this is all Disney stuff. Alien Romulus looks really fucking good. It really I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna see that. I've heard that it has like a very surprising, has it's supposed to be one of the most shocking endings in, in I'll go to the, history. The, my kid wants to go see it in the movie theater, so we'll go oh, see dude, it. Oh, dude, I want to see it. Oh, yeah, and they're doing another Tron, Ron, Tron uh, Aries. I'm, see, I, I, might I, check, I didn't hate that movie. I, I was one of the five people who liked Legacy. But, no, I but even that, even me liking Legacy, the fact that they tried to de-age him and it looked like a cartoon face. That part was terrible. It was also really early movie. on. Like, they could do it now and it looked fine. It looked good. They're they're, they're, they're trying to be a little too too ahead of their times and it didn't work out so well. Yeah, Jared Leto's going to be in the new Tron. I'm just like, yeah, whatever. I don't give a shit. Oh, that guy's a weirdo. Yeah, hopefully he's like bought a bunch of makeup and doesn't even look like him. You can't even tell. Oh, yeah, and The Simpsons. Now more Doctor Who. Boo. There's Coco. So it's all just 
reboots, sequels, reboot sequels, shit we acquired from other it's places because, that's a reboot or a sequel they know to the thing not I acquired. Make any money off of new IPs because nobody trusts their shit. No, no, they don't. But you know, <laughs> as much as like I'm kind of dogging on that, that is the most safe route for them to take. They are they've been bleeding money for years now. They've racked up a shit ton of debt. They lost their fucking uh, sovereign soil in Florida. Like, they've been taking L after L after L. Maybe we should go back to making things the way we used to. So let's do just all slates of sequels. See it. No, That's not what they're going to do, though. We'll no, see. Gonna... Or, or if they do that, they're going to go back to having the main characters and main storyline being normal stuff. But they're going to inject your lesbian yeah, yep. girl over here that's not going to really affect the story. And your, and your bi-racial person over here that isn't going to affect the overall. So they're still going to have that shit in there. That's what they're doing. They're just going to inject been, the shit. They did it with all Semper, the old shit that we like. They've been doing it since cinema was invented. As not long as them. the story is good, I don't care. The problem has never been, oh, they're they're putting girls in like heroic positions or whatever. That's never been the problem. That's just been like the annoying like salt in the wound. The knife is bad writing. No. The problem is that's the story every time. It's not that they inject it into it. They make that the whole story. Is the, the blatant stuff doesn't piss me off because I know it's on purpose. The stuff that pisses me off is like when a girl falls off the side of a railing and she reaches up and grabs the top and holds onto it and swings like that. And it's mm -hmm. like nobody believes that you have the upper body strength to grab that. Dudes would have a hard time with that. You're definitely going to fucking have a hard time or with that. Or like when, uh, you know, like a spy is going against another spy and like the, like the bad spy is like a big... Like muscly spy, but like the good spy is like this little dainty spy who's gonna I'm gonna kick you with my little feet. Yeah, Ooh, and then kick, she kick, jumps kick. up and wraps her legs around his head, spins, and he falls mm -hmm. to the ground. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we just described the trailer movie. for Critical Drinkers uh, short film. <laughs> I just want you to know that. I knew you're going somewhere with that. <laughs> but it's different. He's different, guys. He's I'll so, be back in one second. Look at bow down to the woke guy, yo. Blah, 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 blah. All that shit is fantasy. Like what I mean is like. When it, when a someone is like really obsessed, like say Joss Whedon, really obsessed with like you know girls that could kick ass. It's usually because it's like their fantasy, like they really like they want almost want to be domed or something, you know, like it, it's borderline that, and they're exercising it, through writing it, and Joss Whedon got to live his little fantasies because he had him around him all the time because he was fucking running the shows. Like that's all I see now when I see like. Just an overpowered woman that just kicks the shit out. It's like, oh, you just want to be taken somewhere and a woman beat you and tell you how much of a piece of shit you are. I'm saying Critical I, Drinkers really into, like, getting beat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying Critical Drinker spends most of his YouTube money at a dumb dungeon with a lady. Or maybe it doesn't. I don't know. Anyways, let's look at this next one. We've got a leaked trailer now for... You ready for this, Simper? This is yeah. Daredevil Reborn. I want to I wanna see the I want to see the best UFC female go up to like Tyson Fury and just front kick him in the chest and see what happens. You laugh at her? And yeah, break she falls down her body? backwards. <laughs> uh, she'll, she'll win an Olympic medal. <laughs> God, it sounds like you have a semi right outside your fucking studio. It doesn't sound like that on the stream. Let's move on. <laughs> I don't believe you. I don't important. believe you. Well, then maybe you should listen to our streams and, and put the views on it instead of oh, burn. It does that. Take that. Christ, it does sound like we're getting the signal from the past. Calling. Simper, are you Jim Cabazel? I, I am. I'm, I'm, are the northern lights above your house? I am. Is your dad am, uh, uh, Dennis am, Quaid? I am burnt popcorn Jesus. Do you have your ham radio <laughs> attached to your computer? Yes, as a matter of fact, I do. Are you constantly getting Actually, text I messages right I next to your have it, microphone? I don't have it attached to my computer right now. <laughs> He's a miserable asshole that like, lives by himself. I ate it. He's like, angry about his life. Oh my god, you are Jim Caviezel. <laughs> <laughs> you, you would like a do-over, wouldn't you? <laughs> you just dream about that time when you and your dad were happy. <laughs> Ken, isn't this about the time in the show where you hit 100% on your CPU resources and have to reboot and come back? 
I never have that's to reboot. You. It's my that's internet. That's always you. No, you mine does reboots that. on its own, and that's no, before the show. I just, yeah, that's way worse than mine. My internet sucking. <laughs> you don't even know how your computer works. No, it's my it's my video card when there's updates. I just, I just want people to know control my computer. that I made a frequency reference, and Ken didn't even go, what movie are you He automatically <laughs> knew I was talking about frequency. <laughs> I don't think Dude. anybody's thought about that movie in 20 years. <laughs> I don't That's think Jim Cavazel remembers that movie. <laughs> Dude, 2010 and below, I'm I'm all there. You got anything above that? My brain just gets all fuzzy. It's because the fucking quality gets real fuzzy. All right, so this is the <laughs> trailer for Daredevil. Is Echo gonna be in it? No, but the show is gonna Echo. So in in the spirit, I guess she kind of will be. You're no, talking about the dolphin. We, we actually have um. This guy, I can't remember his name. Oh, Ken doesn't remember watching Echo. <sighs> oh, you know why? I didn't. Okay, I, I didn't watch Echo. <laughs> um, he's like White Jaguar or something like that. But he, the, the actor who played him, just died from cancer. Uh, the guy that you mean, Black Panther? No, it's, his name's like White, White something, White Tiger. Thank you, Nacho. His name's White Tiger, and he dies. Well, the actor died from cancer. What, an, what actor died of I cancer? guess he didn't have tiger blood. I'll look him up. No, that only works on AIDS, not cancer. Oh, oh that's why. The entire system against you. This is the word I'm going to come into this day. It's often David versus Goliath. Oh, shit. They're so bringing that, back what's Punisher? Yeah, they're bringing Punisher back, and uh, they brought, they're bringing, you'll see in a second, Foggy back as well. So this is the actor that plays uh, the white tiger. <laughs> yeah, he's obviously because he's black. He's Hispanic. <laughs> fuck, he died uh, on Christmas. He's Puerto Rican. He died on Christmas. Oh, shocker! Oh, I, bet, oh, Christmas I bet he only. Black. I bet he only had that cancer for six months to a year before it killed him, huh? I wonder where that came from. I feel like God makes people die on Christmas so that, like, yeah, that's what it is. Some Pfizer people, it. some people are just like, I don't like Christmas anymore. He's like, yeah, I know it's it's a little weird. <laughs> My yeah, gift to you that year was really uh, pointed, I guess you'd say. That sucks. He was probably like 12 hours away from right. being like Jesus. <laughs> oh, he didn't die on Christmas. Well, yet? Yeah. No, that was when he was born. Okay. I got that wrong. He should have died in April. I'm no longer the Punisher. They call me Hatchet Dude now. You, you're making fun of him, but I, I have no problem believing that that's what they're doing. I can't do it anymore. I'm Johnny Hatchet Guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Puerto Rican Tiger. They call me Frankie That's... Hatchets. <laughs> they call me Hatchet Hand Frank. Hatchet Hand Frank. <laughs> I lost my hand in in, in a uh, a gun battle as the Punisher, and he just has a hand or a hatchet for a hand. It's like now I just had this hatchet. I'm hatchet. It's hand. really hard to wipe. <laughs> I was a righty too. And they jump sucks. out with hatchets. <laughs> Trying to jack it with a hatchet? It's a mess down there. <laughs> hey, I would I would watch a movie featuring Hatchet and Frank. Oh, we got multiple. Uh, oh, I'm so costumes. excited! Oh, I'm so excited! Not really. I'm just want to see him in the black one. The black one was always my favorite, or the gray Gross. one. Well, and you know, you know now that now that uh, Deadpool has had as much success, the Deadpool Wolverine movie, you know that they're going to start showing all of the uh, original costumes as cameos in all of the Good. other movies. Watch, Good. it's going to happen. Good. People have been wanting one... it for fucking twenty years. Not the whole. That was movie. one of the they're funnier points in um, cameo of it. That was one of the funnier things in Deadpool when he was talking to so and so, and he's talking to her about it. He's like, "Oh, I'm sorry about Deadpool." He's, he's or, not Deadpool. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about um, uh, what the hell is got Daredevil? And she's no, that's okay. Like the whole Ben Affleck thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's like, no, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with it. I was like, holy shit. No, yeah, they, this, this is fucking they hilarious. A, they have reference to Ben Affleck's actual divorce. <laughs> and now he's going to do it uh, again with... Uh, uh, spoiler alert. Whatever the... Jennifer Hispanic Lopez. Was. Yeah, I couldn't, I couldn't remember her name. I was like, Jennifer Love... Jennifer Hue Ass. Jennifer Love uh, Huetos. <laughs> this is Spanish one. I still do Jennifer Love Huetos. I'm just going to put that out there. Didn't they make it, um his total bitch in the last show Echo? Queen yeah, but we're was? just not gonna we're not gonna well, they, those shows. They made didn't they make Daredevil do like the Walk of Shame? Yeah, we're not, we're not gonna boots in his hand. That, yeah. that never happened. <laughs> that, that I was gonna bring happened. that up, but and She Hulk. Yeah. If this show if this show is good, and when I say good, I mean it needs to be like a six, 
Like that's my like my floor. <laughs> that's your that's your barometer for good in Disney. For, is for Marvel right now, yeah. Like if you just make it inter- like there can be tons of glaring plot holes as long as it's entertaining and I'm not getting pissed off every every episode, I will allow it. I will be like, I'm thank getting, you. I enjoyed that. I'm, Can we up it a little bit for the next one? I'm getting tired of the fact that like to enjoy a show, I have to forget everything that came before it. <laughs> it's, like, it's getting so annoying. I was like, oh, I'll right, watch this. Just uh, you go ahead and forget about, uh, you know, the the, the She Hulk thing, uh, the Echo thing. Just you know, this is its well, own little world. Ken, like, Ken, the gonna, the good news fair. is is that most Disney shows now are forgettable, so it's easier to do it well, now. Well, even better. That, so yet, yeah, uh, Semper, most of these Marvel shows, no one fucking saw. No one watched Loki. True. No one watched Hawkeye, which is one of the last times we saw him. No, no one are for saying, sure watched Echo. No, are you no sir, one are you watched Echo. That no one watched Miss Marvel. Is that what you're telling me? Absolutely, no one watched Miss Marvel. I'm <laughs> one of the few people Star that Girl. watched Miss Marvel. Nobody watched Star Girl. Star Girl was actually good. That's not Marvel. That's DC. Oh, that no, one was. That's, that's how little it mattered. <laughs> no, Star Girl was good. That was a uh, that was Jeff Johns' like passion project, and he like based Star Girl off of his dead sister. So it was like a. And outside of you, Star-Girl how is. many people do you know who's seen it or even knows it exists? Star Girl, never even heard of it. It um, was the, the, it comic was the was way flagship. More. It was the flagship show that they made when DC was trying to create their own streaming service mm-hmm. before they switched over to uh, HBO, and so they had uh, Star Girl. They had the uh, uh, the. Doom show, the the one with the that was kind of the anti Avengers where they all lived in the mansion and Doom Patrol? That's still going. Yeah, Doom Patrol. Doom Patrol. That's, that's, that's still going. The Just thing the shit. thing that was actually a pretty good show that only got one season. You mean Swamp Thing? Yes, yeah, Swamp Thing. Swamp Thing was amazing. So they they tried they put a, together this family of DC side characters to try to create a streaming platform and it failed miserably and they sold it to HBO. Yeah. Um Doom Patrol is still going on HBO Max. I think it's getting like one more season. I couldn't watch the last like one or two seasons. It's yeah, like, I, I stopped watching after. I watched the first like two seasons and then I couldn't watch it. The, what, the thing about Doom Patrol that I didn't really care for was just that it was so, it was too close to Umbrella Academy and they came out like the exact same fucking time. And I was just mm-hmm. like, I like Doom Patrol, but I feel like I'd like it more if Umbrella Academy wasn't also out. Because like Umbrella the, Academy the, was better the first season. The, nothing else. Uh, the Robin show was really good for like two seasons and then it just Titans? Went stupid. It was yeah. enjoyable for two seasons. It was not good. Okay. I know. Let's not miss words. <laughs> enjoyable is fine. I'll settle for enjoyable. It was, it was but fun. Then it, just got, then it just got very WB as yeah, it went forward. Yeah, they tried to start doing the Red Hood shit and I was like, no, please yeah. don't. It's too I soon. I tuned out of Doom Patrol when they, they're doing like a montage and you just see this <laughs> this like flubby white guy like like holding up a black dude that's twice his size like robbing him and the, and the black dude's like pretending like he's scared mm-hmm. like it's like oh come on man they're doing like how bad the town is and like some white guy is literally choking a black guy that's twice his size and like can't even act like he's he's a, uh, afraid of this guy i tapped out of doom patrol when they went to the town that was gay like it's a sentient town uh, that literally is gay i don't know how a town yeah, can be gay does it fuck other towns Thing I got out before that thing got. Yeah, that's Jesus. that's what's gonna make me tap out of this dumbass uh, uh, Snowpiercer show that I'm watching. Oh, uh, don't want. Why are you watching the watch show? The movie? Because no, I haven't watched the movie yet. I'm watching the show because there's nothing else to watch right now. Watch the, the movie. The I movie's watching, amazing. The show I'm, is. I'm gonna watch the movie pointless. after I watch the dog shit show. No, watch but, the movie. Watch the show. But I, we, <laughs> there was a there was an episode like I think page. it was either the first season finale or the episode right before the first season finale that the, the uh, Jennifer what's her name. Um, um, that was in Dark Matter. She she goes she goes when we finally go. Jennifer, what's her name? Jennifer yeah. Connolly. Yes, Jennifer what's a speck Connelly. on her name, bitch. <laughs> she goes she goes when we finally got to the point where people couldn't deny climate change, and I was just like, okay, I'm gonna have to fucking tap out of this show. <laughs> no, none of that shit in the movie. In the movie, it's just no. uh, we're on a train. The world ended. It's cold outside. Poor people at the back. Rich people at the front. Let's fucking go. And they did it without bringing up race. It was just like all these random pe- poor people came. And it's in got Chris all Evans. Different. Chris Evans. And the guy and from like, Old Boy. This. Remember, Old Boy. you ever see Old Boy? Is that him? Yeah, that's the guy from Old Boy. Oh, okay. Well, and uh, I Saw the then. Devil. Have you ever seen I I'm Saw the Devil? Walk. No. Oh, Semper. Ken, you guys gotta watch I Saw the Devil, okay? It's, it's the lead actor from Old Boy. He plays a serial killer. And there's like a, it's like a hmm. government, he kills a government agent's wife. And so the government agent's going on a vengeance quest against the killer. And the way... Oh, I I don't want to spoil. It's really fucking good. I feel like this is every Korean movie is a, a vengeance quest, and I'm in for it. Honestly, 
Well, it's it's See, very okay. We can watch it on Hulu and Disney Plus. It's it's very fucking through good. The subscription. It's very fucking good. I, I saw the on. devil. I saw yeah. the devil. Yep. It's on. It's on Hulu. Mm. I saw it on Netflix back in the day. All right, let's finish this trailer. And if you have YouTube pre Prime, goose that guillotine scene. Ooh, ah. fuck! We have some. I'm gonna watch it. I'm, I didn't tell you what Asshole. scene that was. So the guillotine the scene. You won't know guillotine. until it happens. I'll be like, oh, there's a guillotine. Something <laughs> bad's about guillotine. to happen. You'll literally be like, after it happens, you're like, oh, this was the guillotine scene. No, I'm in the northern. It's it's guillotine up here. I'm in the north. Guillotine, right. yeah. I'm not some southern Texas asshole. I'm not some it's French froggy bastard. It's, it's, I'm sorry. Yeah, have you guillotine. heard me surrender once tonight? What? <laughs> I don't think so. I didn't hear any surrender. Mm -mm. Only fight in this heart. <laughs> <laughs> These colors don't run. <laughs> don't tread on me. <laughs> I've never heard that one. That must be no. <laughs> I am going to be there. This caution that you're giving me, who's it from? Murdoch or... I'm so tired of Daredevil. How are you tired of Daredevil? He's been gone for like five years. Yeah, but they wore him out before then. I just so boring. Yeah, they wore him out with like three seasons. And movies, I mean, the Defenders and, wasn't yeah. that great, but it was uh, all right. Yeah, we get it. You're blind. You use sonar. Great. So does Batman. Go away. Use sonar. Batman also doesn't use sonar. What the fuck are you talking about? What are you talking about? You talking about real bats? <laughs> Uh, why do you think Man, his, uses sonar? Why why do you think his head of research quit because he used sonar? That wasn't sonar. That was essentially uh, radio frequency. He imaging. said it was like sonar. So you understood that you could see things with it. Uh, hey, it he said even... it was like sonar. It was like hey, sonar. Hey, Samper, did you know your Wi-Fi router in your house is doing that to your entire house? Someone can tap into your router and literally track you around your house based off the Wi-Fi signal. No. Are yeah. you serious? Yes, I'm dead serious. Oh my god. Not Sepper's house. He's in like a closet with a well, fucking air conditioner. Oh my Two god. Normal dude. people's fucking house. inches away from his, house, his head. You you figure I would have learned something like that, you know, getting my network and communications management degree. Hmm. Do Weird. they cover Wi Fi Never sonar? <laughs> Never under it covers the <laughs> waves and Welcome how to put class together. Welcome class to Wi-Fi Center 101. I'm your, I'm your professor of bat face. <laughs> yes, you learn. You got your communications degree? You don't know how to make a fucking clip? Uh, uh, asshole. Communications? <laughs> communications? Oh, I don't know how the Wi Fi works. I can't fucking clip out anything in the show because I'm on thumbs. You would think somebody that has a communications degree would know how to talk. <laughs> Not your gay liberal arts. I only speak ones and zeros. Degree. <laughs> beep, 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 one, beep, 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 two. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep. Don't make me write fucking That you means in I love you, son. <laughs> Of course, even your degree is ancient. Don't make me write in ones and zeros. <laughs> His degree was written before computer code yeah. was ever invented. Everything he fucking found out from fucking Morse it. code. Oh, I graduated. Beep, 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 beep. Semper went to school with uh, Nikolai Tesla and cheated off It's of actually the same way fiber works, but go ahead. It, it all comes from... from oh, I'm glad you're a fucking genius. You don't know how to clip or do anything <laughs> other than to show up. Nope, I have no idea how to do any of it. Oh, you're you're, you're right, Sipper. I, I should have guessed you would have known that already. Did you hear about the HDMI cable thing? What about the HDMI cable thing? They, I people, don't pay uh, attention to news on HDMI can, cables. People can wirelessly tap into HDMI uh, cables now. Oh, can they? I don't know how it's done, but they can get like a wireless signal off of an HDMI cable. So they can watch all the shitty Disney shows you forced me to yes! watch. Yes! Oh my god, the hackers are gonna <laughs> mass droves now. Everybody just start putting on Disney Plus. Every screen you have. All right, let's finish this fucking dead. Oh, that's if I watch I Saw the Devil and it sucks, I'm coming after your neck too. Dude, I saw the devil's really fucking good. I love that this guy on his phone is filming another guy filming the screen on his phone. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to mention that earlier. I was like, this is a conception. Can we please see that guy's feed instead of this shitty 40, uh, like 55 degree angle feed? This guy's got a better angle and like better definition. Hold on, I want to try something. Let's see. Let's see if this works. Uh, Blow it up to where we're watching that guy's screen of the screen. No, no. What I'm going to do is. Oh, that's not working. Hold on. Oh, yeah. there's a giant. He's going to cover uh, up the thing. Uh, I wonder... What are we doing? Should we narrate this? Can they see this at home? Yes, no, he's going to want you to clip it and it's going to get no views. It's green. Yeah, I know, because I'm looking at a green screen, you retard. How is it green if you've got your green screen on? We shouldn't be able to see it. 
He's gonna he's gonna clip this and put the video inside of his phone. And sir, there's, there's no smoking in here, sir. Sir, there's no smoking. Yeah, excuse me, sir. Fuck you, you Disney. The Eat my dick, Disney. <laughs> there's children here, sir. Please don't use that kind of language. Just put out your cigarette and you know watch this shit trailer. All right, sir. There's a reason we don't make rated R movies, except for the only one that was successful. Bob Iger wrote the Jeffrey Epstein uh, Lolita Express. Sir, sir, your cigarette is on my kid. Can yeah. you, can you sir, get it off? Sir, sir, we don't mind my you ashtray. calling Bob Iger a pedophile. Just please put out the cigarette. It's my ashtray. I'll put it out in his eye when I'm ready. That's all we ask. <laughs> We're not going to believe this is Disney unless you put on a wig and tell everybody you're gay. Oh, shut up. Everybody doesn't need a wig. Yeah, and that's Ken's job. Everybody knows that. I don't wear wigs. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs>